Hi, welcome to this video. My name is Iris and I am reading to you from my book The Wisdom of the Plan Souls, which is available through the School of Easy Living. The link, if you resonate with it in a positive way and get curious, is either here or here somewhere around this video so check that description box and click that link um today i'm going to read from the definitions chapter and i'm going to read about the emotional body and the pain body what does emotional body mean in the soul levels view the emotional body is the realm in which your emotions take place it is linked to many other of your levels and aspects. In itself, it is passive, but it can be activated from many levels in order to fulfill a task, like, for example, manifesting an aspect uh, to dissipate stress, for example, by laughing or crying, or to react to a trigger according to a program or pattern. It can also be involved to support the action of manifesting. If you manage to deliberately control your emotions, you should be mindful that this control is not used by the ego, not integrated aspects of the shadow, nor external systems and programs. This control must be subject to the soul only, for that is the fastest way for you to learn. You will get to know yourself, your friends and family, your entire social and natural environment and how this world works. For humans learn very fast and easy by means of their emotions and they always remember things they learn this way. The emotional body is a part of your human being. Souls have been slowly learning what it is like to not only have or trigger emotions you're welcome but to actually feel and perceive them to really take part in experiencing emotions and to be touched by that to some extent this is a rather new development and it can and will serve you and many others for the highest good of all for the key to your development Happiness and unity on all levels lies in the degree of connectedness with all your aspects and your soul via your emotional body. I know this alone is already a lot of food for thought, but I also want to read what does pain body mean in the soul level's view? Because they are connected. The pain body is the part of your emotional body and your physical body which is in charge of manifesting pain and making it tangible in order to draw your attention to something that has not yet been understood or which can only be manifested appropriately in this way. Your pain body is also linked to your energetic system. Ideally, you should purify this realm regularly so it is released and stays free of programs trying to control you via your pain body. This has repeatedly happened on a large scale worldwide and this does not correspond to divine order as it disregards the free will. So... I want to just add a couple of like personal experiences, observations, notes, whatever you want to call it. Um, cleansing your energetic system is something that you can definitely do daily. <laughs> At least do it weekly or, you know, like... When you don't feel great, that is something that you can go to, like cleansing your system. It's like, you know, you also, you brush your teeth every day, don't you? Yeah. You can also like cleanse your energetic 
system daily. It will not harm you. <laughs> um, and it can help you transform and grow and evolve and develop in a better, easier, faster way, more effective way, because it doesn't, it's less likely that you are triggered by old things and it's, um, yeah, it helps you grow easier. Yeah, that's why this company is called School of Easy Living for a reason. It's not necessary to grow and learn uh, the hard way. It can be easier. And Soul Level wants us to evolve faster and easier. We don't have time for detours anymore, guys. We could and should be on a higher level already. So let's get going. Catch up, y'all. <laughs> like, <laughs> others are waiting, okay? So, um, so we cannot afford to take forever for some evolutionary processes. We should go more effectively uh, through some stages and, and yeah, there is a lot of help for that. And um, I personally appreciate and like it when um, my mind is understanding what's going on because then I can rather make sure that it does not work against the direction where actually things are going. Um, so yeah. And that's why I really like this, what the plant souls call, call this book and, and the other messages from soul level and the other books from soul level, they call them information medicine. I mean, uh, yeah, that's what they call it. They want to help and there is a lot of help and, and they know that humans and yeah, I mean, the free will is a great booster for transformation, for change, for growth. And um, the mind is sometimes... You know, sometimes it's good to, to quiet your mind and be calm and just like feel it and be it and and go through it and do it. But sometimes it's really helpful if your mind is allowed and invited to be part of the the yeah the team that makes up you all of your aspects. Um on this journey so I am very thankful because I learned so much and I understand myself and life and humans and and evolution and the processes on earth so much better because I received these informations and you can also understand these things better um, just have to read it <laughs> okay so Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, have a good time, have good processes, and uh, live easy. <laughs> Bye.